I'm up for the 5 p.m. show, I might change it to 6. This Jeff gets all his ideas, guys, from engine tips. All right, there's engineers over here that write me and tell me what's going on. And sometimes I come over. This time, I got multiple text messages, multiple emails, a couple of comments in the comment section from you guys. You got to see what he found. All right. J uh, weeks and weeks ago, um, Jamie out of Pennsylvania. Jamie, right? Jamie busted me on this when I tried to set somebody up on this one. I tried to set somebody up on the column being down there. And Jamie busted me instantly in the live chat. And I was like, oh, shit. So much for that. So, um, Jamie did a good job. It's sort of like my bucket video where I told everybody it was a vacuum and then multiple people started making my vacuum video. And then I only released it, what, two years I let it sit out there. And then finally this year I said, no damn vacuum. It's just tension around the top of the bucket. And I showed you that bucket thing. Well, this one is uh, this uh, hidden column thing. Do you think, as, as someone said here, do you think they... Let, let, look, this is going to be a short version of it. Let's just go to... See, it's still loading. So let's go to, uh, oh, my over, that was my overlays and all. Let's see. This lady writes, this was published on July 7th. She writes, the tower exterior filmed on 2-26-21. The collapse of the building was, let's see, like three, three months later. So Jack off, uh, J Jeff off thinks that in three months, and anybody else who thinks this, in three months they built a, 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 a rusted rebar reinforced concrete column that takes 30 days to cure at least to get this maturity that they came here and they built this and they put it on top of the the uh, tributary area of a slab that they, they didn't put a foot around it or anything else that they put it there and blocked the driveway this parking area that they think that that that, that was done that's ridiculous to think that all right it's ridiculous and then the building it's ridiculous there is this this transfer beam. If it had to be supported, it would have been supported with real supports, temporary supports. You wouldn't take a thirty to put a, a load on it, and a concrete reinforced structure that takes uh, steel that would take weeks to develop its strength. Um, if you unless you're using a CSA agent, a product, it would take weeks to develop its strength, and you would just lay it on top of there, and now what? It would just puncture the pad. Punch, punch right through the pad. That, that's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. This shows no sign of failure anyway. When you look at it, it shows no crack, no fracture thereabouts on the beam. I'm a cough. <coughs> Excuse me. I think there's another photograph of it. I don't know. I, some of these comments I just glean over. I, I can't read them all. You know, I just can't do it to myself. You know, I, I got too much logical thinking to waste my energy on this. So it was mounted on the underside of this. This is thereabouts where it came off of, right there. So he's saying this was mounted there and it shifted forward um, because this would have been there. No, this didn't. Sh this doesn't make sense. This is more in line. This is more in line with the other two columns, which will put it out of line for where this one, this column, and the. the gosh, let me see if they got an aerial. I'm about to kill myself. The alignment from here to here doesn't even put this, oh, I don't know why I'm doing this, you know, some things, please, if you guys can please not tell me, I don't care who you are, engineers or not, please leave me out of Jeff's post, please, he, he's a con man, I do, at the five o'clock show, I go over it again about his con artist stuff with the damn car stuff, all right, where he did the car sticker thing, all right, I don't want to be involved with the fucking con man, leave me out of it, all right, so there is this to return here to here. Ah, I should have did it in one shot. Let's do this again. Hopefully to give me an L. It doesn't. But let's move it over to there. That puts that way back there, the end of that tip, which broke off way back beyond there. If this is there, that puts it way back there. This, this is just a K column. I go over that in the show at, I go over that in the show at, uh, at five o'clock today. Hopefully I load, but hopefully I load this one up right now. Please leave me out of his friggin' stuff. All right. I don't want to be bothered with the con man. I'll, I now I know you guys donate and everything else. I appreciate that. But none of you donators contacted me as far as I know. 
it was only people that don't donate that, that contacted me about this. So just just leave me out of it. Leave me out of it. I don't care about his videos. Whatever he posts, it's just over. He's just coming over there, stealing from engine tips, whatever they might be. Oh, there's his engine tips. Whatever. If you go back, just go to engine tips, look at this thing there, and you'll see that his videos, besides maybe this one, proceeds, uh, uh, pro uh, uh, or is preceded by all of their comments as someone told them down here that look nobody's complaining about you going to put our content on your channel is what they said I saw that a long time ago because some engineer wrote me said you should see what he said no I did not watch his video this is the title of it and I will not watch it all right so this is just not there you're going to be very surprised about the date I present in the five o'clock or it might get to push it to 5 30 show Thank you, and sorry about my irritation. It's just that I, you know, it's like trying to deal with a child. You guys keep telling me to, to dispute an idiot, a con man. Look at his car sticker video. It's going to be at the noon, the noon's thing. You know, he can't slander me for that. He's the one that blocked the sticker. He's the one, that, and like I'm using the con man as in the reference to what you guys call them. You know, and I think he's just, I think it's, 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 it's some type of, uh, 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 an artist to be able to do what he does and live with yourself. A an artist to be able to do what you do, what he does, and live with himself. So he does follow the go all the way back here. Unless he deletes it, you go back here in time, and you can see where he starts picking up his content. He only came here. Oh, that's right. I forgot you can search people here. Oh wait a minute. So then I would just find his name and click on it. I don't come over here, Charlie. Charlie wrote because they tell me when Charlie. He's bad mouth. I mean, Charlie, what are you? What are you? One of my negative ones that give me one over there? Stick with your computers, Charlie. You do good with computers. Stick with that. But there's no reason for you to bad mouth me over there. You know, I'm I'm not. You know, just leave me alone. What the hell? I like this Newcomb guy. I think he's funny. Um, I like a couple of structural guys. An industrial guy is funny too. Um, where is? So you just click on someone's name and you see how long they've been here. Uh, well. Where's Charlie? I mean, uh, whatever, that clown. Uh, did I go too far? Oh, yeah, I went too far. I'm looking at the dates. So you click here, and I've been a member since August 30th, 2021. Wait a minute. Right. So he watched forever. He signed in 156 times. Last signed in November 9th. So you can see that he just came over here to get the data. So if you're going to find your stuff before then, he probably just watched and took. And then after that, you know, they confused, they, a couple of people accused him of just taking their stuff off of this channel here. You guys look at the comments. Unless he deletes them, you can find the comments where they say, hey, look, we've already talked about that. Now you're trying to take credit. They call him out on it. A few people don't like it. They, they call him out on it. And I don't blame him. I'm calling him out on it too. He's, you know, stick to his little, you know, Lowe's and Home Depot crap and leave me the hell out of it. <laughs> 